Hi, you're watching Got Space Game and it's time for DCS and 3 or less. Today we're in the Vigan, showing how to use rockets in both salvo and full ripple modes. As always, useful control bindings will be on screen at the end of the video. First, let's set up our rockets. Turn the weapon selector dial to attack. Release mode to single for the first target. This will fire one rocket from each pod. Bring up the kneeboard. Our targets are at waypoints 2 and 4, so let's designate both as target waypoints. Data panel dial to tactical. Input mode, code 9. Waypoint 2, code 9 again. And waypoint 4. Go back to output mode and current position. Now we need to set the altimeter to our target QFE. These are at 1013 and 1012. They're close enough that we can split the difference. As we pass waypoint 1, we'll turn in on our target at waypoint 2. We'll be running in at 1500 meters altitude. When we're aligned with our target waypoint, we can set our master mode to attack. The target is now marked with a small circle on the HUD. If we bring our head down a little, we'll see the rocket symbology. Pippa, current altitude, and our ranging queue. Note that when you unsafe the weapons trigger, the targeting circle disappears. We'll keep the trigger safe until we have visual on the target. As the targeting circle disappears under the nose, we can start diving in on the target. We're aiming to get the targeting circle roughly in the middle of the HUD. The reticle will pop into view once we've got an accurate slant range. Unsafe the trigger. And for this salvo shot, we'll aim just short of the target. Line up the targeting dot. There's the ranging bar, wait for it to shrink. Shoot Q. One salvo fired. Pulling hard away and onto the next target. We'll be attacking this one in full ripple mode to empty the rocket pods at once. Safe the trigger and set master mode to nav. Verify that the next waypoint is selected. Set the firing mode back to group to unload that full ripple. Line up on the target waypoint. Set master mode to attack. Get lined up properly with the targeting circle. We're about 10 kilometers out, so let's nose up with full afterburner to get to 1500 meters. Throttle back and establish a dive. There's the targeting circle. Ranging queue. Shoot queue. Weapons release. And that's all of our rocket. Now the hard turn to safety. Fly low and fast, do that big and thing. Safe your trigger, set your master mode back to nav and return to base. I've been Dan, you've been watching DCS and 3 or less from Got Space Game. Massive thanks to all my Kofi supporters. If you found this video useful, please share it and subscribe to the channel for more 3 minute DCS tutorials covering all of your favourite modules.